Right, I'm going to have a quick look at the DV10 manager software to control the AOR DV10. So we're in memory mode on the radio. Three memory channels programmed, all in bank zero. Channel zero, one, and two. So let's fire up the software. Okay, so it's picked up the two VFOs, and we can switch VFO with it. VFO Z, back to B, back to A. Okay, so that works. All right. Let's look at the memory channels then. So, nothing appears in this box. So, bank zero, select. Radio selects bank zero and nothing appears in here. Can't click in here, nothing happens. This is all greyed out. Uh, scan bank. Does nothing. This piece of plastic's getting in the way now. Stop scanning, well it's not scanning anyway. So that doesn't seem to do a lot. Uh, so, search channels. Okay, so it's picked up search channels. Search banks, rather. So let's edit one of these. Let's change it to 439. Save. And it throws an error. And I've worked out this error is because when this software reads it, it seems to fill up the tag with spaces, and that's what it doesn't like. So that needs fixing in it to start with. Click save. So that says 439 now. Let's refresh it. That says 439, so that seems reasonable. Let's exit out of that. Back into the memory channels. Still nothing in here, nothing working at all. Uh, oh, let's try and raise this bank. Clear the bank. Oh, it says it cleared the bank. The screen looks partially corrupted though, as if the message didn't disappear completely. Anyway, it did something. So switch it back to VFO. Still working. Okay, so let's go back to the search. Let's try and add a new search bank in here. Bank 5. Let's just go here, band 118. 136. Let's just put auto in there. 25 kilohertz. Save. No indication it did anything. Let's close that, let's open it again. And it doesn't. No, no, it's bank 5 is gone, it's not there, not done anything. So, okay, let's see if we can search a bank with this. Okay, that started working. Change to bank 2. Save. Display is looking a bit corrupted now. Oh, and there you go. A radio is now locked solid. So. There you go. AOR's recommended software that the author claims has no problem whatsoever. And they claim the radio has no problems there either as well. And there it is, the radio locked solid. And let's hold the power button in. Can't turn it off. None of the keys respond. software.
the radio is locked absolutely solid. And there's absolutely nothing you can do with it now without removing the power and the battery. Absolutely jammed. So that's the AOR DV10 being controlled by DV10 manager. Lock solid, now unusable without pulling the battery. Not good.